Alright everybody, back with part 5 for Tomb Raider 1 Remastered here, and we are now in Egypt, so I think things are probably going to start getting a little bit crazier than they have been. Our pistols might be uh, getting less and less powerful, but we're still going to go for the hard-boiled run. Yeah, I guess the Skion is how Larson pronounced it. I always thought it was pronounced Scion, but uh, maybe I'm wrong on that. Maybe it's just how they pronounce it in this game, but looks like it might be capable of world destruction. Guess we're gonna find out. Holy shit. Big fall there. Take, we're gonna wanna get up there, but we're also still going for our secrets. It's still going for our pickups. There's a total of 24 on this one and three secrets. I think there's actually a pickup in this area. Can we move these? Um, no. I can move this one. This looks like it's like a door or something. There's an alcove up there, though. Can I just make this jump? Yes, we can. Faster than shimmying. Here we go. <laughs> Can also move this one above me. So I'm probably going to want to move that. Our pickup's probably behind this block. That's probably what it's talking about. Yeah, I've really been enjoying these. It can be a little frustrating sometimes, but for the most part, it's a pretty awesome game. I'm definitely a lot further than I've ever gotten in these games in the past. I don't even remember exactly when I briefly played them, how, how far I even got. I don't think I ever made it to Greece or anything like that, so... Basically, been playing a game I've never experienced before. Alright, let's move this again. Yeah, we got two pickups in here, actually. Only good thing about getting the pickups on the hard-boiled run is we have more than enough med kits to keep us alive during fights. Alright, we should be able to get out of here now. Ooh. See some Egyptian stuff ahead. Wait, is that the... Is that like a... Undiscovered Sphinx. Whoa, what the hell is that thing? We have some pickups above us here. Oh no! Thank god it only pushed me. Holy Jesus Christ! I think take some damage. Is that like some demon dog? Is that supposed to be like an Anubis? Let's grab these. If you notice the difference in the sound effects, I actually have a sound effect mod installed right now where it makes some of the uh, sound effects higher quality. Uh, it replaces some of the PlayStation sound effects with the PC version sound effects. So it's just basically, like like I said, it's just better quality sound effects, basically. And we have some shotgun shells on top of this pillar we have to get. Is that a mummy? How would I get up there? Oh, I didn't even realize that was a slide. Looks like we can climb this, though. Oh no! I'm gonna have to get a running jump on that. Anyways, we have actually two pickups in this water, I think, too. There's one right here, I see the other one. And he's just waiting. 
Oh, wow. He can jump and do shit. I did not expect him to get a massive speed boost. Jesus Christ. God damn, this thing's got some health on him. Oh, he just explode. He explodes with fire? Oh shit, man. They're really gonna ramp it up here. Oh, we might- No, wait, I might be able to just climb up here. Yeah, there we go. Exploding zombies, alright. Got those shells. Alright, I think we actually have to get on this thing. Nope, I might slide. Oh no, we're good. Yeah, here we go. We got some more pickups up here. Looks like we have a key up here. Alright, so we can't go through there. We do have a med kit right there, though. We need stuff for this, too. I take it this is our main way out of here. That's also sealed. We have a block we can move. <laughs> Guess let's see what's in here. Oh, is this what our key is for? Well, this looks kind of... I feel like... Is there a trap in here or something? We have a pickup right here, though. No, we don't have a trap, but we have an enemy. Oh, great. He's just going to be running around now. Damn, these things are fast. Are the thing's still alive? There we go, it's dead. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Enemies are pretty resilient in this chapter. Oh shit, there's another one. There's no way that thing's still alive. Alright, we got it. Yeah, I've been seeing a lot of debate on what, what control scheme's better, like modern or classic. And to be honest, I think there's benefits to both. But I feel like it's just whatever you're comfortable with. Because you can actually do mostly everything you can do in tank controls. It's just there's different ways of doing it. Like, you can just backstep if you want. If you do, like, if you look... You can do back steps, but you don't really need to do back steps for running starts because you can spin Lara around like this so she can get all the momentum she needs without exiting the block. So you can just do long jumps without needing a running start, really. So there's just different ways of doing it, but I think it's just whatever you're used to. The, the downside to modern controls is the camera can glitch out. Uh, they need to fix that. And then the other downside is there's just really no tutorial. 
tutorial on how to do it. You have to like go to their official website in order to really learn what all the buttons are supposed to do and what the shortcut is for them. Because the other thing you don't need to do is you don't need to walk backwards and perform like a back step to catch the ledge anymore. You just hold the action button and she automatically does it for you. Um, I should probably save. I haven't saved in a while. We're at 49 saves. I just know we have a med pack in here, but I don't, I don't like long corridors in this game. Figured that would have been trapped or something. If I'm on track, though, I think that was our 11th pickup. Yeah, alright, we're still on track. Alright, now what? Got a lot of different paths here. Oh, this is a pool. Not sure if I want to go down there yet. Let's see what this... Lynx is up to her cat. Alright, so we're clearly gonna have to do something with that. Jesus, it's a boulder. Where the hell did that even come from? I hope that didn't trigger something that I wasn't supposed to trigger just now. Let's see what we got down here. I see a lever. Gators. Did it seriously just leave? God damn it. I hate enemies leaving unaccounted for. Got a block here. You can see through this. Wait, that's the beginning area, though. Wait, is that a lever above this gate? Okay, wasn't sure if you could actually angle it. I literally just saw that gator. Oh, it's right there. Alright, so I gotta... I gotta go two different ways here. Guess let's start with this one above me first. Yeah, I heard, um, I heard Tomb Raider 2 and 3 have a lot more combat in it and are actually much more difficult than this one, so I'm curious to see how that goes. And I'm still debating whether or not I'm going to do 4, 5, and 6 afterwards. I heard 6 wasn't really all that connected, but it still is considered the 6th one. And then I was also debating if after that I should do, like, Anniversary and, um, Underworld and stuff and Legends. We'll have to see. Alright, sometimes there's like weird achievements for taking close looks at stuff. This thing's missing a vase. Hmm. 
Do I need to find the vase? What did that do? Oh, it put that thing out. How does that actually help me, though? Do I need to push this block? I'm gonna need to move it all the way over to this. push here that should help me here hopefully yeah we're good um shit do I want to move this block that way probably right oh shit God, I can't believe they put it in such a confined space. <sighs> okay, thank God it doesn't set you on fire. That would suck. Okay. Right, that opened up a ceiling. Dude, these exploding mummies, man, I'm just not looking forward to constantly fighting them. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Alright, let's try this again. Oh, we walked through these, what the hell? <laughs> Alright, maybe I can just get to the edge here. We actually have another pickup up here that is in a really weird spot, I think. I think it's directly across from us. Is there anything else over here, though? Oh yeah, there's a lever right here. Okay, there we go. We can get beneath that thing now. Does it want me to do anything with this? Alright, let's go pick up these magnum clips. Oh, this is actually our first secret, too. Alright, there we go. See, this is like the situations where the camera can get all screwy. Alright, but before we head back. We can actually just get down this way for some more pickups. Got a med kit here. It's weird though, that area is not listed as a secret. We do have a secret over by that archway. That's supposed to be where the first secret is. So I'm not sure if that one we got is supposed to count. Here's some magnum clips as well. This is going to be a tricky jump. There we go. It must have counted the secret early. What is that noise? Oh, there's a gator down there now. No. Here, let's check, actually. Yeah, okay. It, it just counted the secret up there. I think this is supposed to be the secret, though. But, before we go into this hole here, we actually do have another secret that I walked past. It's actually in this corner right here. I think we have to make the jump from here not to slide. Yeah, there we go. Oh, you really have to walk all the way back here for it. 
two items in here. I think we can finally go down here now. Seems like quite a drop. I think we have more magnum clips we gotta pick up down here. Yep, here's the first set of them. I wanna go down here? Alright, that opens that. I think we do have another thing of magnum rounds right here. Yep, here we go. Our, our next secret's somewhere in this chamber as well. Jesus Christ. Can it really stop hiding behind this pillar? Dude, this is so annoying. The pistols are so weak now. Alright, it's dead. I think we have to go down there for some pickups too. Apparently out of these doors. Whoa, Jesus Christ. Not expect more of them to pop out. Are they both dead? Our next secret is apparently up here though. It's right across from me. Did it just open? Oh yeah, that other door opened. Okay, here's our final secret. Damn it, man. I always have to go in hiding. Alright, we're gonna go down there and land on that one rock again, but I'm gonna heal. <sighs> Holy shit, these things do some damage. Um, why did she- really? She waited to climb that whole time? <laughs> Son of a bitch. Alright, we're back in this area. This time, they're all dead. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why it took so long to register the climb right there. Because I was facing the right way. We have, uh, two health kits in both of the hallways that they come from. A large and a small. I don't know why the hell it's so dark in here. Jesus Christ. What does it look like in original graphic mode? Oh, wow. There's like artificial light inside of them. They should have added more artificial lighting to certain areas. For um, the remastered graphics. I'm assuming we want to be back up here. But which way do we want to go? I can't do anything in this direction anymore, can I? I can only go this way. Oh, 
Oh shit. I see an opening. God damn it, I can't move. <laughs> you dick. Oh, it's so perfect every time. God, these guys are annoying. Jesus Christ. God damn. They can jump your height and everything. I just want to heal up again. But every time I would just be like right about to grab the ledge, he'd hit me off of it. Got something up here. After this key, we should only have one more pickup. Another area up here. I think our last pickup is actually, yeah, it's right across from me. Hmm. Probably should save. Probably want to focus on smaller jumps. Alright, that should be all 24 pickups. Let's double check that. Yep, 24 of 24. Three out of three secrets, so we're good to go here. We just need to figure out how to get out of this level now. Um... Oop, that's not what I wanted. Still alive. <sighs> what would that have done? They used to actually, like, show when you'd pull a lever what it exactly would do. The only other thing is we have that, um... We opened up that one other hole in the floor where the, like, the cat statue was where we moved the floor panels. So we can check where that is, I guess? Not really sure what the lever above me did. It sounded like it poured a whole bunch of sand out of something. I think that chamber was right here, wasn't it? Yeah, it was right here. But this looks like it just leads to, um, that one area. Oh. It's all flooded where we fought that mummy now. How am I going to get up there, though? Oh, never mind, we can just walk up from here. Am I supposed to be able to grab this? No. Whoa, what the hell? Oh, okay, wait, I see it now. Back where this uh, chamber was, where all the sand poured out, I didn't even see this on the wall, but there's a keyhole right here. <laughs> it's 
really well hidden in here. I should have switched to classic mode to check the corners. Oh, that's actually the end of the level right there, too. Alright, nice. Got everything. 33 minutes. Now where are we? Obelisk of K-Moon, or K-Moon, however it's pronounced. 38 pickups? Holy shit. That is a lot of pickups. Well, let's see what we got. Uh, it doesn't look like the stairs lead anywhere here. <laughs> Looking at the pickups, seems like there's a lot of stuff hidden behind pillars. Is there a key? There's a keyhole thing right here. Um... Do all of these lead somewhere? <laughs> that leads to water. <laughs> Do I actually want to move all of these though? I think this is the way I want to go maybe? <laughs> oh shit. Now I'm holding X. <laughs> Alright, he's down. First pickup is somewhere around here. Do I have to pull this? Probably. Oh, actually it's even darker in classic mode. In this stage. Oh, there's our first pickup right there. Shit, I think I might have fucked that up then. Unless I can climb it. Okay, we're still good. I wasn't sure if I had to land on it from above or something. One out of 38. <laughs> Looks like this is where that door opened. Oh, we have a pickup in here as well. Don't want to fall yet, but it's right here. Alright, this led us back into this room. Okay. Think I want to go this way now? This is going to be a confusing level. Yeah, I think I'm in the right area. Here's more of those, like, reflector mirrors. Is that... Oh, there is a mirror. It's swimming on the perfect angle. I think we have a pickup underneath the water. Whatever. <laughs> it's just gonna keep rotating into the wall. All right, there's that pickup. <laughs> it's just gonna constantly be underneath me. I think I actually, I have two more. Oh God, I was holding X. Let's say this is a perfect time to shoot it. We have two more pickups in the water. Let's be wise to get rid of him. Yeah, there's magnum clips, and I think, it, yeah, here's our key. 
Yeah, I can just imagine swimming around not finding that key and then wondering what you're supposed to do next. Alright, that's everything in this chamber, I'm sh pretty sure, for pickups. How do I get out of here, though? Suppose I could just swim out. I don't think I have to do anything with these yet. Yeah. Guess we just swim back out. There's another pickup behind this pillar, I think. Oh shit. Alright, he's down. Yeah, I think we have a medi pack in here. Yep, here we go. Alright, now that we have a key, though, we might be able to actually open that door that was right here. There's also something up there, too. Right, yep, it's used for this. Oh, it actually opens up two different pathways. There's some shells right there. So before we explore, we can actually just pick this up right away. There's some magnum clips in the water as well, but I think we want to actually check out that upper door first, because that might actually just lead back in here. I'm seeing the those things that we could put in the pillar in the previous level. It looks like they're right above me. So it looks like we're going to constantly keep coming back to this chamber. And I gotta move these blocks. Well, one should do. I don't need to- I don't even need to put this up against the wall either. Should be able to just make the jump. Wonder what's behind that pillar. Wonder if we even have to go that way. Alright, let's see what we got up here. Oh, shit. God damn it. I'm gonna have to just have another really close encounter duel with one of these things. Oh, this works. Still take a shit ton of fighter damage though. Hey, you can just kind of run circles around them. There's a lever right here. Ooh, I almost walked too far forward. Alright, we can already collect one of the symbols. Why did it show me that? Alright, I'm not seeing anything else. So, I take it that opens at some point. These are all walls on these. Actually, this one's open. Oh shit, I can't see. It's a wall. There we 
we go. They're down. I think we actually do have another medi pack in here. Am I going to get higher up? Can I get up from here? <coughs> yes, we can. There's our med pack right across from us. God, dude, this is going to be a long level. How high up does this go? Guess we just keep climbing, right? I think. <laughs> Actually, I have no idea. Oh, shit. <laughs> Didn't want that. I haven't saved in a long time, might as well just do it now. I wonder if it'd be easier to just go the other way, this way. This just keeps going. see a switch ahead of us. That lowers that. Oh, Jesus Christ. God, that guy came out of nowhere, Jesus. <sighs> Can I actually make it to the... thing? Actually, wait, let me go back down there. We do have a med pack right there, too. Let me just grab that really quick. There's some clips right here as well. Three pickups right here. We can't get down to that yet. That must be from somewhere else. Alright, let's just keep going this way. That Where is this gonna lead? There's some shotgun shells. There's a switch up there. Oh, I think I just saw something moving. It's dead. What did that switch do? Oh, wait. I think it turned our slide into a staircase. I think we have a pickup back here, though. Yeah, we do. More magnum bullets. Alright, we should be able to get those shells now.
God damn it. There we go. So yeah, I mean like even like with the gun poses you can still um side flip and stuff like that too. What's here? Oh, we can actually grab the thing from here. Here's another pickup though. Go. The thing's not a slide anymore. Just grab that really quick. Nothing back here. All right, let's see where this leads. Oh shit, does it want me to grab that? <laughs> Sketchy jumps. That's like one thing I love and hate about platformers. I love when it gets intense to where it's like these really sketchy jumps and then like you land it and then you make it because it feels really good, but if you miss it sucks. Especially if you don't save for a while. I don't think that's a handhold. <laughs> Too close. I don't even know if this is really faster or not. Oh god, what, another zombie, our mummy, yep, shit. At least I have a circular room here. Ooh, we actually dodged the fire that time too. Two levers. I don't know if you could do that on tank controls, to be honest. Run around them like that. Ooh, there we go. Another one of those. Here's our next pickup, though. Oh, we can actually make it to that center pillar if we get on that one ledge. I'm going to have to backtrack for that. Is this another shortcut? Think. But yeah, we're gonna have to backtrack to where the, the, that area was. Does this actually lead back there? Yeah, it does. Okay. I think this is actually our first secret for the area, too. Follow There's another secret followed directly past it, too. I'm gonna save really quick, though. Before we do this. That was close. Very close. Yeah, our next secret is on the pillar ahead of us behind that mirror. That is a sketchy jump. Actually, wouldn't you just be able to climb? Right? We probably didn't even have to do that. Oh. Wait, we can actually grab this too. Right, there's that. 
All right, now I think we want to go this way. I think our third secret is in here as well. I think it's past this. I think we got to shimmy over. I think it's going to be right above us here. go that's all three secrets man they're like really close together two more pickups got shotgun shells ahead of us as well all right now we got to actually figure this room out God, they just jammed a bunch of pickups in here. Um, well, I'd imagine probably wants me to go down. Let's just walk around to be safe here. Camera. See, that's, when, that's the one issue with modern controls. When you're like up against the wall, you can't, you don't know which way you're going to be walking. I don't know if I'd survive this height. No, you idiot. God damn it. I wanted to shimmy across. I was holding right trigger to do the 180, but she just didn't want to do it. Alright, we got it that time. I think it might depend on where I have the camera facing, but sometimes she just doesn't do the 180. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be on this side yet. Is there anything up here? Not that I can see. Hey, wait, what's the point of this? Oh shit, there's actually two of these guys? You gotta be kidding me. Oh wow. This is, this is, this is ridiculous. Oh wow, they're actually still hurting me. God damn. I only saw the one when I died. Jesus Christ. Did I actually have to come down here? Or... I'm not seeing any levers to pull. Weird. I don't think there's any reason to actually be down here. I don't know where the final lever is then. Alright, I think I, I think I found it. Right where we dropped down when we started fighting those guys, I think we were supposed to shimmy all the way across, because I didn't even notice the the way you could walk in from here. It's going to be a weird jump. It's a very confined platform. I wonder if you could actually avoid those mummies altogether. Or if, I don't know, how would you get back up though without dropping down? Yeah, this is probably where our switch is going to be, though. Yep, here we go. Alright, we can get the final one. Yeah, you would have to drop down anyways from this point. 
So you would you would eventually fight those mummies. I guess, I mean, unless you could get to this platform quick enough, but those things are so goddamn fast. Slowly but surely, get our way back up here. Pick up our last item for our, well, our main path. There's still a bunch of pickups we need after this. I think we can actually get an achievement now, too. There's, a, there's an achievement for collecting six item pickups in one breath, so we're probably going to end up losing health in order to pull it off. But I th we have like six pickups under the water in this section, so I'm going to make a save really quick. Alright, let's try this out here. I don't know which way I have to go. Is it straight ahead? Yeah, okay. There's one. We've got two more up ahead here. There's three. We've got three more in this upper chamber that we're swimming to. You can do this in one breath. You just have to use med packs, I think. Because you start losing health once you're out of breath. We have one more. There we go, we didn't even have to use the med packs. Did he not make his way over? Alright, nice. Would have looked like he would have been able to walk. But there we go, we got it. Crocodile tears. We actually made it relatively decently too right, before we get out of here we got some more pickups right here <coughs> all right we only have two more pickups now I think one of them's in this chamber up ahead. Trying to hit us. Oh, what? How? Yeah, right. Actually hit me. Yeah, one of our pickups is right here. Now we have to leave this chamber, apparently. Wherever the exit is. Here we go. Oh, we're all the way back here now. Apparently behind this block is our final pickup. Yeah, here we go. Alright, well yeah, I mean it makes sense that we had to come back here. That's where that pillar was. So we should be at 38. Yeah, 38 of 38. Okay, good. I heard some people complaining that after picking everything up it was at 37, but we're, we're good. Place all of these. Why didn't they just make it one solid platform? <laughs> Seems a little tedious to be, uh, separated into s squares like this. Alright, now we can get out of here.
This was a sizable level, Jesus. A lot of stuff going on. There we go, we beat it. 42 minutes in total. Alright. We're probably going to end part 5 here, though. Oh, locks us in. I can already see a pickup for this level. How many pickups are there on this level? 29. Damn. 29 pickups to look forward to. Less than the previous level, but still a lot. I can already see a ton of them. Wait, the shields? We gotta pick up more of them? But yeah, this uh, this part was intense. The enemies they're adding now are taking a bunch of pistol bullets, so hard-boiled is gonna get that much more difficult. I'm, I'm not looking forward to the final boss. I feel like that's gonna probably be a pain in the ass. But we're getting there. Um, I think that there are four chapters in this game. So like three different areas. I think the fourth chapter area is just a secret achievement. Though if the mural in the beginning or at the end of part four was anything to go by, it, the final area is probably Atlantis. So we're I think we're halfway through Egypt now. So we're getting there. But yeah, it's getting more intense. The platforming is also getting a little bit more complicated. So we got to hone our skills even more now but i'm still thoroughly enjoying this game it's really fun you just have to get used to a lot of its systems um i i like the modern controls i just i hope that they do fix up the camera locking up when you're up against the wall and stuff like that because that can be annoying uh because you don't know which way you're gonna walk sometimes but everything else feels really nice with it they just have you wait to do stuff, so like if you're just button mashing, you're going to have a harder time doing it. And then you can roll in midair and stuff like that, so it, it all still works. But yeah, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in part 6.